The cemetery in the Midlands is looking to become a historic landmark, and the association in charge of the cemetery is asking for community assistance to make that happen. News 19's Chandler Mack tells us more. I am walking in one of the largest cemeteries in South Carolina. Palmetto Cemetery was founded back in 1920 by Willie Johnson, and for decades, it was one of the few places in the city where African Americans could be buried. Those who have family here tell me that this cemetery is more than just a resting place. There's souls resting here. Yeah. Mm -hmm. and, and that's, that's what people get to understand. Vanessa Briggs has lived in the Midlands her entire life and says the cemetery means a lot to her family. This is my grandmother. She was born in 1894. My cousin Johnny, her daughter, Aunt Nadine, we called her Big D. We would come out and come with jugs of water, plants, rakes, and just clean. And it makes us feel good because we're doing something that, uh, we're carrying on the legacy that was given to us. That legacy is why Briggs works for the Palmetto Cemetery Association, who are hopeful to make the cemetery a historic landmark. But the association has had trouble finding funding to maintain grave sites for several years. Now they're asking the public to join them in maintaining what they say is already a historic landmark in the city. You don't have to uh, uh, wait till someone is deceased to come here to help to, to beautify this and maintain it. You should feel confident in knowing that you have some found resting place that someone is going to take care of. My family's here and many other people's families are here. And this is where we come to mourn them. It's a home It's a and there's a lot of love here. In Columbia, Chandler Mack, News 19, WLTX. And if you would like to make a donation to help preserve the cemetery and help make it a historic landmark, visit WLTX.com for further details.